गंगातरंगरमणीय जटा कलापम गौरी निरंतर विभूषि वाम भागम नारायण प्रिय मनंगमदापहारम वाराणसीपुरपति भज विश्वनाथम वागीशजुष्व बदने लक्ष्मीजस् वक्षसी यस्ते हृदय संबिहिंगमह भजे हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे निगम कल्पतरोगलित फल सुख मुखा अमृत दवसंयुत पीबत भागवत रसमल मुहुरहो रसिका भुवि भावुका निगमो कल्पतरोगलित फल सुखो मुखाद अमृत दबो संयुत पीबत भागवत रसमल मुहुरहो रसिका भुवि भावुका गौरगोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर पहुपा परमहंस जगत गुरु टोल्ड व्हेन आवर डिजायर एंड द डिजायर भगवान गोइंग टू मैच इफ द डिजायर भगवान गोइंग टू मैच विथ आवर डिजायर इन दैट केस A man can become happy. Gauriya Goshti Bhati, Sri Sri Lavakti Sri Danto Saraswati Goswami Jagat Bhopat. Paramahansa Jagat Guru told, when the desire of Bhagwan going to match with our desire, then and only then we can become happy. Otherwise, there is no question. We can never become happy. Bonded soul having different kind of Annavilas, different kind of desire, enjoying mood, which is called contamination of heart. So long as contamination of heart is there, nigama kalpataro golitan phalam. This amrita, Bhagavad Bhakti, we cannot get. It is not possible. Somebody asking. How to call Bhagwan? How to call Bhagwan? Somebody asking. Papa speaking. It is the advice of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Sila Papa speaking. It is the advice of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu to become Tenadu Bishunich. Then and only then our prayer can reach up to the lotus feet of Bhagwan. Sir Sachidan the Bhakti Mantra writing, "Dhoyno atmo nivedan gopitya varan avasya rakshivan Krishna Vishashapalam bhakti uno bhakti ano kulo karjo bhakti ano kulo matro karjo sikha bhakti prati kul bhav parjan." स्वरंग शरणागति हईवे जहाँ ताहार प्रार्थना शुने श्रीनंद कुमार शिला सच्चिदान भक्ति मंत्र स्पीकिंग दैन्य आत्म नवेदन गोपतित्य वरण दैट भगवान कैन प्रोटेक्ट मी हंड्रेड परसेंट दैन्य हमलनेस दैन्य आत्म नवेदन आत्म नवेदन टू सेल To sell our head unto Lord Sita Bhagwan, Dhanu Atman Nivedan Gopitya Baran, Avasya Vishu, Avasya Vishya, Avasya Rakshivan Krishna. I am already protected by Bhagwan, and Bhagwan can protect. Bhagwan, I am already, you know, maintained by Bhagwan, Gopitya Baran, maintained by Bhagwan. Dhanu Atman Nivedan Gopitya Baran, 
অবশ্য শিওরলি অবশ্য রক্ষিবেন কৃষ্ণ বিশ্বাস ও পালন শিওরলি ভগবান ক্যান প্রোটেক্ট মি ভক্তি অনুকূল মাত্র কার্যের শিকা ফেভারেবল টু ভক্তি এনি অ্যাক্টিভিটিস ফেভারেবল টু ভক্তি উই ক্যান অ্যাকসেপ্ট এনিথিং এনিথিং ফেভারেবল টু ভক্তি উই ক্যান অ্যাকসেপ্ট অ্যান্ড হুইচ ইজ নট ফেভারেবল টু ভক্তি উই ক্যান ডিস ডিসকার্ড দিস ক্যান্ড অফ সারঙ্গ সারঙ্গ সিক্স সিক্স ফোল্ড অফ শরণাগতি শিলা সচিয়ন্দ ভক্তি স্পিকিং শিলা সচিয়ন্দ ভক্তি ঠাকুর স্পিকিং ইফ দিস ক্যান্ড অফ সিক্স ফোল্ড অফ শরণাগতি ইজ স্যাটিসফাইড উইথ আস অ্যান্ড অনলি অ্যান্ড অনলি দেন অনলি অ্যান্ড অনলি দেন উই ক্যান গেট কিপা মাই আই মিন আওয়ার প্রেয়ার আওয়ার প্রেয়ার আওয়ার অ্যাপ্লিকেশন can reach up to the lotus feet of bhagwan i mean bhagwan can pay attention to our request proper speaking gaur shandar it is the advice of gaur shandar to become tinadapi otherwise our application our prayer cannot touch the lotus feet of bhagwan you can remember when some people going to going to feel helpless sometime in our life this kind of situation we can meet when we are feeling helpless we are very our our futile efforts cannot give result when we are not going to feel that we are very small infinitely small when we cannot feel that we are useless our life is unstable hmm. when you can feel we are very useless our power is very very useless in that case we can call bhagwan if we are not going to feel our tinada vibhav till then our prayer cannot reach up to the lotus feet of bhagwan and before growing tinada we of course we can feel our uselessness we are useless we have no power all nothing we have we are helpless when we are going to help feel helpless then we are then we can take shelter of somebody when we can discover there is no other way when we can discover that there is no other way except taking shelter of somebody then we can take shelter not before that this way proper speaking that without tinadu vibhav we can we can never do hari naam sankirtan hari katha nothing we can do regarding siddhanta vichar regarding siddhanta vichar etc if we are not going to depend upon pure guru vishnu then surely we can come out failure we cannot come out successful it is a usual rule in our society we are watching some important personality very big important personality maybe false but big spiritual leader papa speaking it is useless to ask about any siddhanta vichar or any vichar uh, regarding vishnu calendar we cannot ask any question in front of a 
मुस्लिम लीडर काजी मुस्लिम रूलर इट इज यूजलेस ना वैष्णव कैलेंडर और हिंदू पारब दोजुआ हिंदू दे आर फॉलोइंग सेपरेट कैलेंडर इफ समाइम दे आर गोइंग टू आक्स वी कंसल्ट विद काजी द रूलर मुस्लिम रूलर एम्पॉर्ड बाई ए किंग इन सर्टन लोकालिटी काजी काजी मीन वॉज अ गिविंग जजमेंट लीगल जजमेंट it is useless because they he is very much into he is never he is not interested about in the param this way papa speaking some smart pandit many people many people going to ask many people going to consult with smart pandit or some so called spiritual leader or mayavadi About Vaishnav Dharma, Ashuddha Bhakti Prachar, or any stiti, any special thing regarding bhakti, some foolish people going to consult. They think they are also sadhu. Why not? Some Mayavadi, some wayward devotees, Martha devotees, Shahjiyas. We are going to ask about Vaishnav Dharma, Ashuddha Bhakti, Bichar. we are going to depend upon them because they have popularity na if there is some if there is some <coughs> if there is some difference of opinion if there is some difference of opinion you know with uh, difference of opinion with pure bhakta and some pandit or famous mayavadi if this kind of problem happens i mean what vaishnav thakur shuddha vaishnav going to speak common people they are not ready to accept they are approaching a uh, spiritual leader is mayavadi or smartha pandit or sahajiya to get some solution amicable solution they are going to convene one meeting where they are going to discuss the matter and it is seen that their majority their majority vote they are they are going to enjoy majority vote i mean they cannot understand what a shuddha guru vishnu is going to speak they are going to enjoy majority so according to that they are going to think it is okay so it's okay that means that sadhu that shuddha vishnu is useless is not speaking this way it is the usual practice of our society to depend upon some famous man famous in the sense they are famous in the society they are going to depend upon them regarding one bishuddha vichar or any siddhanto ani tithi those common people under the guidance of those you know so called spiritual leader and mayavadis they are going to speak all wrong and vaishnav thakur is going to speak all perfect siddhant but still nobody like to accept because they say majority must be granted what to do this way common people are cheated this way common people are cheated the sahajiyas mayavadis so called spiritual leaders they have some power in the society and common people also going to be controlled by them they are not going to pay any attention to shuddha guru vishnu regarding shuddha guru vishnu we can say their activities their speech their looking eating they nobody can understand bhajan mudra vaishnaver kriya mudra vigyana bujhay 
Vaishnav, the activities of Vaishnav, Kriya Mudra, what he is doing, what he is speaking, even it is impossible for Vigya, knowledgeable person, to understand. Of course, a pure Vaishnav can understand. Even demigods in the heaven, they can also they can also misunderstand a pure Vaishnav. There is a condition. They can surely misunderstand Devota Vaishnav Chinitya Nare Devere Shakti. Bengali, but in Sastra we know Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya Chaitanya. Vaishnav Chinitya Nare Devere Shakti. Common man cannot understand even so called devotees. So called devotees and they can never understand the activities of a pure Vaishnava. And those who are Sahajiya, those who are Mayavadi, those who are wayward devotees, they how they can understand the activities and of Guru Vaishnava. Vaishnava Kriya Magda, Kriya Mudra. Vigyana Bhujaya. Vaishnavir, Kriyamuddha, Vigyana only, even knowledgeable person they cannot understand. Also, those who are staying in heavenly planet, they were demigods, they also cannot understand. So, now, we are discussing about our Gopagumar. It is really impossible to understand that a Gopu Kumar is a pure devotee, his kinchan. It is really impossible to understand for anybody to understand, to realize the activities of Gopu Kumar. Gopu Kumar is niskinchan, totally niskinchan, no desire for anything, anything from this 14 world, nothing Gopu Kumar want. Only want to do seva of only want to do seva of Jagadish. That is his desire. According to the instruction of Guru Pat Padma, he is chanting that mantra. Guru Pat Padma already told that you can never grow your age, same age you can maintain. Whenever you like to see all secret Leelas of Bhagavan and to realize everything you can do, this can be done by the, by the exclusive power of this mantra. What I, what I told you to chant, Guru Dev told. So this way up to now, so this way up to now we can understand, Gopakumar like to get the service of Bhagavan. And now, Gopakuma reached heavenly planet. It was possible. It is really possible. It is really possible by the power of this mantra. By the power of that mantra, nothing was impossible. So, Gopakumar, by the power of that mantra, finally went there in heaven. There he met, there he met with, there he already met with Jagadish in the form of Bhamandev, because Bhamandev is there in the heaven as the elder brother of Indra Maharaj, Indra Maharaj having Affection at the same time in the marriage is very ever Bhagavan coming in the form of Bhavandev. So naturally some avi, some avi respect, you know, there. So there Bhavandev Ji Maharaj, Jagadi is going to take puja. of Indra Maharaj and all demigods they are watching every day. I was thinking 
that how it is possible for me to get the luck like Indra Maharaj, because Indra Maharaj he himself going to worship, and Bhagwan gladly going to accept. Mahendrena archate sargo vibhuti vi raso prabhu bhakti tena ishvara tena sharana tena chanyam. Manasi akarabam chaitad aho dhanyaha shatakratuhu yohi sri vishnuna dhatyam shadaitva nirakulam. I was appreciating Indra Maharaj and his luck. How nice you see how lucky Indra Maharaj is. He is going to, you know, Bhagwan going to take service from him. And at the same time, Bhagwan going to give them security, protection in the heavenly planet from demons, everything. Bhagwan going to protect Indra Maharaj. So I was very impressed to see. I was very impressed to see, you know, Mahendrena Archati Sargu Vibhuti Bhira Soprabhu. Bhakti tene sharat pena saranat tena chanyaham manasi akarabam chaitad aho dhanyaha satokratu yohi sri vishnu nadatyam sadahitva nirakulam trailakvai sharyam ashaddu bhagavantam imam trailakvai sharyam ashaddu Bhagavantam imam muda upaha upohar chayair dibbair grichamanoi shayam chajit. Bhagavan going to accept. <coughs> Bhagavan going to accept all the offerings of in the Maharaj. I was really very happy to see. And I was thinking myself, when I can get this kind of chance to serve Bhagavan directly, is it possible for me? Evam mamapi, evam mamapi bhagavan ayam kim kripaishati iti tatravasan kurvan sa sankalpam nijam japam. I was thinking how it is possible for me, I was thinking that how it is possible for me to get the seva of Bhagavan. Can I get this kind of luck? That Bhagavan can get directly seva from me. Iti Tatravasan. I was thinking, I was thinking this way. Bhagavan can fulfill my heart. Bhagavan can fulfill my heart to take seva directly. Anyway, with this determination, <coughs> with this determination, with this determination, I went on chanting my I went on chanting my mantra very exclusively. I I stayed there in heavenly planet <coughs> with this conception. Someday Bhagwan can bless me or not. After watching the lack of Indra Maharaj, after watching the lack of Indra Maharaj, after watching, after watching the lack of Indra Maharaj, she was very happy. There was no jealousy inside Gopu Gumar, but he was very much impressed to see the lack. First point, he is the king of heavenly planet. Second point, Bhagavan going to take service from him directly as a younger brother at the same time. You know, there are so much facilities, everything. So, inside the heart of Gopakuma, there was one desire. I like to get the luck of Indra. 
I like to get the luck of Indra. This way, he wanted to get the luck of Indra because Indra getting this kind of facility. So with this mood, because Bhagwan going to give full protection, no problem. Bhagwan is going to protect from demons. And Bhagwan going to accept all offerings from uh, Indra Maharaj. So internally there was there was a desire inside the heart of Kupukuma to get the position of Indra. Follow, because he was appreciating the appliances and uh, appliances means uh, the luck of Indra Maharaj. and all very famous because in the maharaj is famous as satakrutu in the maharaj is famous as satakrutu 100 ashamet yagya 100 ashamet yagya was done by indra maharaj in the maharaj very lucky bhagwan Bhagwan is his younger brother, so Gopakuma somehow wanted to express some desire to get the luck of Indra Maharaj. He wanted to serve Bhagwan directly, but this is not for possible for everybody. Gopakuma wanted to get this kind of luck anyway. <coughs> this way, Gopakuma. This way, this way, Gopal Kumar was thinking inside heart, when and how I can get this kind of kipa. When, when and how I can get this kind of kipa. That is the main problem. I was thinking, and as per the, and as per the assurance, as per the blessings of Guru Pat Padma. Gopal Kumar going to get everything what he is thinking. The mantra going to give everything. The mantra is so powerful. The mantra can give anything or what with 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 any desire. With any desire, if somebody going to chant that mantra, can come out successful to get that thing. Though we are sure. The Gopal Kumar is Tina. The Vibhav is there. Tina, the Vibhav is there. I mean, Gopal Kumar is surely Vishnu. At the same time, we have many such documents, evidence that Gopal Kumar was less interested about that kingship of Purushottam Dam. Still, before that, when he was in some temple. As a in charge there at the bank of Ganga, there also he was less interested to enjoy so many things. So he wanted to get the chance like Indra Maharaj. That is the main thing. So he went on chanting that mantra, Japa of that mantra. At the same time, inside heart there was this kind of desire. They wanted to get the and a scope like Indra Maharaj. <clears throat> this way some day what happens some day in the maharaj what happens some day some day there was one problem what is that problem athai kasya munindrasya dushayitva priyam balat lajjaya sap bhitva लाप भीतवा च शक्रु कुत्रापि अलियतः अथैकस्य मनिंद्रस्य दुषयित्वा प्रियं बलात् लज्जया शाप भीत्ता च शक्रु कुत्रापि अलियतः सम डे व्हाट हैपेंस in the maharaj was attracted by one mataji i mean the wife of gautam rishi 
So Indra Maharaj could not check himself. He was bound to go there in the form of the husband. I mean, in the form of Gautam Rishi, in front of Rishi Patni, wife of that Patni. This way, due to this kind of uh, illegal association, finally, Indra Maharaj was very sorry. Indra Maharaj was very sorry. He was feeling very sorry. Because what kind of wrong thing I have done? Due to this thing, he was feeling very fearful. He was feeling fearful, very very fear. Because if money, if money, if Gautam money can come to know about this kind of illegal activities, then surely, then surely. Gautami Muni can give cards. So due to this reason, Indra Maharaj wanted to hide himself in certain place, both with sighfulness, he was feeling very shy, at the same time in fear of getting some cards from that we see. If the king is not present in the kingdom, then the situation breaks down legal order everything can break down those demigods they tried their best to search out in the maharaj those demigods those demigods they tried their best to search out in the maharaj but they were not successful they wanted to search out Indra Maharaj, but they were not successful, not at all. Finally, they couldn't know, they have, finally, they could not get any information. Finally, those demigods, they could not get in, any information about the whereabout of Indra Maharaj. In that case, when Indra Maharaj is absconding, when Indra Maharaj is absconding, in that case the situation, legal order, you know, order of heavenly planets was very disturbed. Because all demigods, all they started making problem in political level, it is the usual rule. Everybody like to find faults with other. It is the usual rule in political field. Everybody like to find out some weakness of the opponent. This way, all demigods, eh, you know, they are feeling disturbance because laws and order break down. All different kind of problems started appearing in heaven. Because the demi, those who are demons, they, they started making some problem. Finally, what happens? Sri Vishnu Raghayan Devair Guruna Peritvai Ratho Vaindre Pade Ovishikto Aham Adityadi Anumoditaha. Finally, According to the instruction of Vishnu, I mean Jagadish, Bamande, all demigods, they wanted to give me the post of Indra. Indra Bade Vasitugal. Not wanted, they wanted to give and they already give, already gave. He was, Abhishek was done by Brihaspati, Devaguru, to make him king of the heaven and all demigods including the mother of Indra, I mean the mother of all demigods, Indra Mata, Aditi and all the friends and relatives of Indra Maharaj, they all approved my kingship.
all the relatives and friends advisor minister everybody they approved my kingship i mean i was elected king tato aditim sachim jeevam brahmananupi manayam trailokke vaishnavim bhaktim purnam pravartayam sada after getting chance after getting this kind of facility i never wanted to misuse i never wanted to take undue advantage in this way i was though i was elected as the king of heaven but still i never wanted to misuse the scope i have so i started giving huge honor to aditi the mother of heaven demi you know indra mother of indra sachi wife of indra devaguru brahaspati who is a brahaspati in chair all brahman sadhus rishis i started giving their due respect appropriate way naturally it is not it is not one philosophy those who are vaishnav real vaishnav anywhere they are going the anywhere they are going they are always going to show trinada vibhav they are always going to show trinada vibhav never they want to transgress this kind of rules and regulation siddhanta vichar they never vaishnavas they vaishnavas they can vaishnavas they can always give appropriate honor to others it is possible vaishnavas they are always giving appropriate honor to others vaishnavas they are always giving appropriate order honor to others because amani manado amani amani mane amani i have no false ego manado mane i never i am not interested to get any honor rather i like to give honor to others that's called tiran so i started giving appropriate honor and respect to aditi ma i mean the mother of indra sachi wife of indra and devaguru brahaspati and all brahmans vaishnavas they are rishi muni so i started giving huge honor to them and why because i wanted to install krishna bhakti vaishnavi bhakti vishnu bhakti and to to install vishnu bhakti there though demigods are not against bhagwan but still devotion is not there perfectly sometimes they can also go against bhagwan they are not against bhagwan sometime we have seen in the maharaj fighting with you know krishna because krishna going to take some you know special tree from heaven parijat viksho also at the time of banasur fighting they are also shankar bhagwan they started fighting with krishna so gopakumar speaking i wanted to install i wanted to install krishna bhakti vishnu bhakti prachar anyway anyway you can see why pallad maharaj was given the post whereas pallad maharaj was less interested to get the post pallad maharaj was less interested to get the post of king sir but still nishingo bhagwan wanted to give him the king sir nishingo bhagwan was nishingo bhagwan wanted to give him the king sir you know why 
Nishinga Bhagavan wanted to give the kingship, whereas Prahlad Maharaj was less interested. But by the order of Nishinga Dev, he was bound to take the control over this country. Bhagavan also wanted to make Dhruva Maharaj king. Dhruva Maharaj never wanted to become king. I mean, after meeting with Bhagavan, before starting, he wanted to get some post. But after getting Siddhi, he never wanted to become king. But still, Bhagavan wanted to make him king. Because if one Vaishnava king is there, because if one Vaishnava king is there in the kingdom, in the whole country, then it's very good. If Vaishnava king is there, then it's very good. Because Vaishnava king can teach us all devotional practice. Vaishnava king always can teach us Vaishnava king can install different kind of rules and regulation of Shastra. It is for so that's why Bhagavan, Bhagavan, that's why Bhagavan always want, that's why Bhagavan always want to make a Vaishnava king. Because if Vaishnava king is there, then Bhakti, Vishnu Bhakti can be preached, like Yudhishthir Maharaj. Hello. Bhagavan himself wanted to make Rashiya Jagyo, wanted to give the authority, total sovereignty all over the world. It was given by Bhagavan himself because Bhagavan wanted to make him king because he is Vaishnava. So finally, Gopukuma speaking. Sri Vishnu Raggaya Devair Guruna Piritoir Atho Sri Vishnu Raggaya Devair Guruna Piritoir Atho Vendri Padi Avishiktu Aham Adityadi Anumadita Tato Aditim Sachim Jeevam Brahmana nopi manayan Trailaki Vaishnavim Bhaktim Punyam Pavar Pravartayam Sada. I wanted to install Krishna Bhakti there in the heaven. That is the man. Now some speciality was now some speciality was discovered. Now some speciality was discovered in the behavior and character of Gopakuma. Some speciality was discovered in the behavior and character of Gopakuma. Because first point, he wanted to get the facility like Indra to serve Bhagavan. Okay, but regarding appliances, position, he was not so interested. He only wanted to get the luck of Indra Maharaj. Regard Indra Maharaj can worship Bhagavan directly. This way, <clears throat> this way, finally, Gopagumar was successful to sit in the throne of Indra Maharaj. Though, though Gopagumar never wanted to sit in the throne, seat was, seat was already reserved from him. The seat was already, the throne was already reserved from him. But he never wanted to sit in the throne. Swayam Tasya Prabhavino Sarajji Upi Yathapura. 
सदा किंचन रूप ओम नवसन नंद ने बने दो आई वॉज इलेक्टेड एज द किंग ऑफ हेवेनली प्लैनेट बट स्टिल आई नेवर वॉन्टेड टू लिव इन द पैलेस ऑफ इंद्रा रेदर I took decision to stay in Nandan Kanan like Niskinchan devotee <coughs> because I was already given I was given chance I was giving I was given opportunity chance to stay in to stay in Nandan man by those demigods according the instruction of Bhagwan so I was very happy there. I never wanted to go and sit in the throne of Indra. I never wanted to go inside the palace. Now Gopaguma speaking to the Brahman. Now Gopaguma speaking to the Brahman who is from Guwahati. Gopaguma speaking that look, I was successful to meet with Jagadish directly. Gopakuma speaking out of humble attitude to that Brahman, I mean disciple of Gopakuma, because that man already wanted to submit, already submitted. Mantron, mantra not yet given, but still, although Guru Pada Sraya, according to this formula, we can say that that Brahman from Guwahati is actually disciple of Gopakuma. and gopagumar also wanted to to speak all in details about what all happened in his own life regarding bhajan <coughs> gopagumar speaking though i was successful to meet with the supreme lord jagadish you know by as a result of that mantra japa <coughs> as a as a result of mantra japa i was successful to meet with jagadish directly vishnu also as a result of mantra japa i was very curious feeling curiosity to watch what is heavenly planet so i also went there i go that's why i never wanted to leave chanting that mantra because this mantra going to give everything how can i stop chanting mantra because this mantra is very powerful so i never wanted to leave that mantra by the influence by the power of such a mantra i am getting all result whatever desire i appear inside my heart i am getting everything if i am going to leave if i am going to stop chanting mantra then surely i would be treated as not gratitude no gratitude will be there <clears throat> my if i am going to stop chanting mantra then surely i am not gratitude i am not going to express my gratitude unto lotus feet of mantra so i could not stop chanting that mantra so i started living in nandan kanan in nandan kanan from the very beginning because i was giving place because i was giving i was giving place there in nandan kanan by supreme lord bhagwan jagadish and all demigods so i was very much interested to stay there but still by watching that nandan kanan beautiful beautiful very very beautiful you don't know nandan kanan where is nandan kanan when i went to badi narayan akeda narayan then first of all you will have to meet gauri kunda and before reaching gauri kunda there is another way where you can get trijogi nath where shankar and parvati marry each other that is a particular frame place where brahma arranged their marriage 
that place is there and from there you will have to go more north 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 west direction there is one place very nice is called pawali pawali mean one place where all different kind all different kinds of flowers are available there all different kinds of all over the world wherever what flower available all available there very nice is called nanan kanan ordinary people cannot reach there is very difficult because the place is very sharp very sharp high you know sharp sloping nobody can go ordinary people cannot go so i didn't think it necessary to stop chanting mantra because if i stop chanting mantra i am not going to express any gratitude because by the power of that mantra i was getting everything eh? anyway after that watching that after that what happens gopaguma speaking by watching that beautiful forest nanan kanan <clears throat> i was thinking about prajabhumi again i feeling again i was feeling attraction to prajabhumi i remember about the beauty madhurya excellency of that vrindavan dham so prajabhumi i started thinking again prajabhumi i was i started feeling attraction for prajabhumi what to do how to go so even after living in even after living in nandan kanan even after living in nandan kanan it was not possible for me to forget vrindavan dham vrindavan forest vrindavan banming forest day by day i started feeling some pain due to separation from brajadham i started feeling heavy my face and body started drying due to separation from brajabhumi i was feeling heavy pain inside my heart all my face and body started drying all my face and body started drying all my face and body started drying then by watching my painful condition then by watching my painful condition jagadish jagadishwar jagadishwar vishnu bhagwan wanted to give me some consolation by placing his blissful hand on my body and head hasta kamalara repeatedly bhagwan wanted to give consolation and you know amrita by touching the body touching my body and bhagwan started speaking all sweet words which is more than nectar amrita maya vachana he started drenching he started drenching all sweet sweet word into my heart obviously into koi the like naturally here one thing sanatan go sai pad wanted to speak that is the excellency of vrindavan and brajavasi that is the excellency of vrindavan and brajavasi it is strange that it is strange that even after getting the facility it is strange it is strange that even after getting the facility to stay in nandan kanan which is very very rare which is really very very rare 
but still gopakumar could not forget vrindavan dham that is the excellency of vrindavan dham though nandan kanan is really excellent nandan kanan is really excellent a very very fine place where all demigods are enjoying but still gopumar could not get such enjoyment as was there in bindavan gopumar could not get that kind of enjoyment as was available in bindavan dham gopakumar could not get that kind of that much enjoyment which was available in bindavan so he started thinking finally he was feeling separation from painful separation from bindavan because there was extraordinary facility braj bhumi is full of transcendental bliss and specially gopakumar was given one special mantra which is not available in heaven that mantra is madan gopal mantra i already told if you are going to chant that mantra of madan gopa and physically and mentally if you are going to stay in vrindavan da is more practical suppose 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 you are going to chant madan gopal mantra so you are going to chant so if you are physically and mentally present in vrindavan dham then it is more practical because this is the leela kshetra it is the leela place of madan gopal leela kshetra of sakshat bhagwan nandanandan krishna so naturally so naturally gopakumar was feeling some separation because as per the desire of gurudev as per the desire of instruction of gurudev he is chanting that madan gopal mantra at the same time gurudev told when you are doing jap japa of this mantra you can if you desire you can meet with madan gopal dev magan madan gopal bhagwan and you can develop baba under the lotus feet of madan gopal if you are going to chant if you are going to chant that mantra with full sincerity if you are going to chant that mantra with full sincerity then surely you can get darshan of madan gopal that was the that was the blessings of sadguru bhagwan sadguru so you see what happens i started thinking about brajodham i was feeling a pain inside my heart all my body and my face started drying so by watching my painful situation jagadish wanted to put his blissful hand on my head and body and he wanted to give amrita amrita he wanted to give amrita my bachan speech वा तोकदुक्षणुतपम तोकदुक्षणुतपम शुष्कान शुष्क अनुनो अहम जगदीश्वरेण तोकदुक्षणुतपम शोकानोन अहम जगदीश्वरेण संलक्षो 
तोषेय मुहु कराबजस्पर्शेन चित्रैर्वचनामृत भगवान स्टार्टेड प्लेसिंग हिज ब्लिसफुल हैंड ऑन माई हेड एंड बॉडी एंड स्टार्टेड गिविंग कंसोलेशन टू मी वॉन्टेड टू ड्रेंच वॉन्टेड टू बेस्ट टू अमृत ऑन मी बाय स्पीकिंग सम वर्ड विचित्रैर वचना मृत Bhagwan wanted to express his Baba as an elder brother of Gopakumar, but the Baba of Indra was just opposite. Indra was elder brother, and Baman Dev Vishnu was a younger brother. But here, but here in this case, here in this case, just opposite. I mean, Bhagwan. Vishnu Baman Dev going to show such affection to Gopakumar as if like younger brother. Jesto shodaro sammanda mibo palayata swayam tas tatoshanayo madhyam bhogyam adayo vujyati. Bhagwan wanted to treat me. Bhagwan wanted to treat me as a younger brother, my younger brother. He used to show so much affection to me. He used to accept all my offerings to him. He used to ex. He used to accept all my offerings to him. He used to accept all my offerings to him. That was a speciality to give me, give me a prakita ananda. Jesto shodaro samman, jesto shodaro raso, jesto shodaro samman da mivo. Again, I am reading. ज्येष्ठ सोदरो संबंधमीव पलयता स्वयं मत्षणा मद्यम भोग्यम आदा भुजते ही यूज टू एक्सेप्ट ऑल मई ऑफरिंग यूज टू टेक एक्सेप्ट एवरीथिंग आई यूज टू एक्सप्रेस यू नो एफेक्शन लाइक ए लाइक एल्डर ब्रादर ज्येष्ठ सोदरो संबंधमीव ज्येष्ठ सोदरो संबंधमीव पालयता स्वयं मत्षणा मद्यम भोग्यम आदाय भूयते मद टू गिव मी ट्रांसेंडल प्लीज टू अरेन्स यू यूज टू एक्सेप्ट ऑल मई ऑफरिंग्स and used to give me the treatment like a elder brother that's why by getting this kind of sweet behavior and blessing teno vismitto tad duksham pujaya purbo vrtvaya prinayan sneho bhavatyam lalayam kanishthavat What happens? Gopakumar speaking. Teno bismitto tad duksham pujaya apurva brutvaya prinayam snehu bhavatam laloyam laloyam kanishtavat. After getting this kind of affection, tremendous affection from Bhagwan. After getting this kind of tremendous affection from Bhagwan, at the same time, by by accepting my all my offerings, Bhagwan wanted to give me so much love. So naturally, 
by getting this kind of exceptional love aprakito love day by day i started forgetting day by day i started i started forgetting about my pain of separation from vrindavan dham so i also started doing seva of bhagwan to so finally this kind of biraha feeling of separation from vrindavan dham gradually i started for i i started you know forgetting i mean because due to tremendous love and affection shown by bhagwan so naturally i was feeling i was out of painful situation this way bhagwan wanted to restore bhagwan wanted to help me restore my health broken health because my face and body was dry up already there एवं शास्त्रो शस्ता ने कुचि गिस्वे गोपकुमार स्पीकिंग ही भगवान आफ्टर गेटिंग दिस कैंड ऑफ ट्रिमेंडस एफेक्शन एंड लव फ्रॉम भगवान आई स्टार्टेड फीलिंग लेस अबाउट वृंदावन दैट कैंड ऑफ feeling of separation was not so much painful to me at present and after giving this kind of consolation upendra basati sriman na labbate sadekshitum evam mam shastum evam mam shastum apaddu shasthane kutra chidgata उपेन्द्र वसती श्रीमान न लभ्ये तो सदीक्षित आफ्टर आफ्टर रेस्टोरिंग माई हेल्थ माई पेनफुल सिचुएशन आई डोंट नो वेर भगवान गॉन बिकॉज वन थिंग आई हैव सीन Bhagwan appeared there. I thought Bhagwan staying in heavenly planet, there heaven. But in heaven also he is not available all the time. In the first part of this Bhagavad Bhagavatam, as I already told, somebody going to appreciate Indra Maharaj. I mean Naraji Maharaj, you are so lucky. You are going to get the direct seva, Bhagwan. He is staying in front of you as a younger brother and going to give you full protection from those en enemies like demons. You know. At the same time, Naraji Maharaj was bound to say, "Je, hey Indra, King of Heaven, you are so lucky, so lucky." But there also, though Naraji Mara started appreciating, glorifying the position of Indra in the heaven. I am not speaking now. Before, first, maybe one and a half year before, I told. That time, Indra started crying. You can remember, na? First part, comparative statement. If somebody, you know, Indra going to Brahma, Brahma will say, "No, Shankar is lucky. Shankar going to no, I am not lucky." This way, gradually, uh, we we go, you know, Sanatan Goswami path wanted to show us comparative statement. There we see, after appreciating Judishir Maharaj, Naraj. <clears throat> After appearing Narati Maharaj, I mean when, when Narati Maharaj going to appreciate Judishir Maharaj. 
After that, uh, here or not, it is actually heaven. When Indra, when Naraji Maharaj is going to glorify Indra, Indra speaking, actually I am not lucky. Bhamandevji Maharaj Bhagavan staying in front of me as a as a younger brother, it's okay. But he is not always staying. After taking puja, he gets vanished. Where is staying? I don't know. I have no information about the whereabout of Supreme Lord. Whole day I am not speaking. Sometime he appears. So Gopagumar also speaking the same thing. After rest, after restoring my health, my mental health and you know physical health, I don't know. Bhagavan gone to some other place where he is actually living. That I have no information. I don't know where Bhagavan is actually living, but he gone. After giving consolation to me, after uh, after giving consolation, he gone already. That's why. Gopagwa speaking, always and every time, always and every time, you cannot, always and every time, you cannot see Jagadish, Vishnu, I mean, Bhamandip Maharaj, there in the heaven. Where is he staying? I don't know. Then some sort of reaction came inside my heart. I started thinking, well, Bhagavan is not staying with me all the time. It was far better, it was far better for me to stay in Purushottam Dham because as and when, as and when I desire, I can go and take darshan of Jagannath is open. Uh, here in heavenly planet, everybody is speaking that Bamandji, Bamandevji Maharaj staying in heaven. But where? I cannot find him all the time. So, I started feeling pain, I started feeling pain. Tato yo jayati, tato yo jayati, shokasti no nila chala prabhum, achala srita vasalyam, drashtu micheyam metutam. After that, when I am not going to find, when I cannot find Jagadish all the time in heaven, so I was really feeling disturbance. I thought it was far better in Purushottam Dham because at least there I got the facility to see Bhagavan all the time. It's more merciful, not going anywhere. Basalya. Jagannath out of Vatsalya, out of Vatsalya Brava, he is giving darshan all the time. Eh? Jagannath Mandir is open whole day. Sometime close, but whole day open. Sometime Prabhu eh, taking prasadam, that time is closed for some time. Otherwise, Jagannath Mandir in the world. Only Jagatnan Mandir is whole day open. Any poor man, fallen soul can take darshan. Of course, Panda, they have some restriction purposely. I don't know. So, I wanted to take decision. So, I wanted to take decision to go to Purushottam Dham. So, I took decision to go again. So I took decision to go to Purushottam Nam again because it is far better. Nilachal Pati, Jagadish, Jagannath always going to give darshan out of his affection, Patsalla. So better I can go. I cannot stay in heaven because Bhagavan not always staying here. Sometime coming, sometime going. Tato jo jayati, shokasteno nilachala prabhum. 
अचलाश्रितवात्सल्यम दृष्टुमिच्छेम इतो तम आई वॉन्टेड टू रीच जगदीश जगन्नाथ वेरी क्विकली बट वॉट इज द मैग्निफिकेंट खिपा ऑफ भगवान की अपूर्व खिपा इफ इफ भगवान एज एन वेन भगवान गोइंग टू डिस्कवर दैट माई दैट माई हार्ट इज लाइक पेंडुलम आई मीन ओसिलेटिंग like to go away from heaven as and when my as and when i was feeling disturbance in my inside my heart then immediately bhagwan used to reach me and used to give me some satisfaction consolation he used to accept puja from me he used to speak sweet words as amrita this way as and when i am feeling disturbance as and when i am feeling disturbance this way then bhagwan used to appear and give me consolation and love everything so this kind of pain so this kind of pain due to adarshan no due to no darshan of jagannath was somehow you know under control my painful situation my my shoka tapa my shoka <coughs> my pain my feeling of separation somehow was balanced by by jagadish because time to time when i am feeling this kind of separation bhagwan used to appear in front of me he used to accept all my offerings taking puja and giving me consolation and very very nice sweet nectarian words giving assurance to me this way i also after getting this kind of affection this kind of pain used to get vanish used to get vanish time to time it was the arrangement of jagadish what to do so gopakuma now speaking so now gopakuma speaking to that brahman hey brahman this way i stayed there this way this way mean as a king of heaven as a king of heaven i stayed there in heaven you know and one year gone dev mane dev mane mean according to the calculation of heaven not according to the calculation of this material world because in material world one year gone that is equal to one day follow one year gone mean one day in the heavenly planet so according to the calculation of heaven one year already gone i stayed there get, get getting the right of indra so i stayed there suddenly one day what happens evam nibasata tatro evam nibasata tatro shakrutvam adhikurvata brahman sangvasaro divyo mayeko gamitah sukham this way one year gone when i couldn't calculate according to the estimation of heavenly planet already gone evam nibasata tatro shaktu tvam adhikurvata evam nibasata tatro 
शक्रोत्म अधिकता ब्रह्म संवत्सरो दिव्यो मयको गमित सुखम हाउ वन इयर अकॉर्डिंग टू द कैलकुलेशन ऑफ हेवनली प्लैनेट और गॉन फ्रॉम माई लाइफ सडनली वॉट है अकस्माद अकस्माद आगता स्त्रो भृगु मुख्या महर्षयो पद्याम पावयुत स्थितीर्था कृपया भुवि वन डे सडनली आई डिस्कवर वन डे आई मीन सडनली आई डिस्कवर दैट ऑल मुनि ऋषिज दो स्टेइंग इन महर लोक बिकॉज भूर भुव स्वर महर यू नो आपर न आपर लोक ग्रेजुअली प्रमोशन भूर भुव स्वर महो जनु तपो सत्य तो हियर इट इज लिखिन महर लोक डिफरेंट डिफरेंट लोकास दे आर डिफरेंट डिफरेंट यू नो डिफरेंट डिफरेंट मनी रिसीज अकॉर्डिंग टू देर राइट दे आर स्टेइंग not that anybody can stay anywhere not that there are some particular place like in the heavenly planets who can stay have some qualification urvaswa bhurvaswa mah mahar lok tapo lok jano lok tapo lok hai na bhurvaswa mah jano tapo satyo this way now gopakuma speaking suddenly i discover Gopagama speaking. Suddenly, I discover some Muni Rishis, like Bhigu Muni, etc., from Mahar Lokvasi. They are the resident of Mahar Loka. They are staying there in Mahar Loka. Suddenly, they came in heavenly planet. I saw them. What is the reason? i mean why they are coming in the heavenly planet what can be the reason the reason was discovered as very excellent reason is very unique very divine purpose what is that all those who are living in different places in different pilgrimage all sinful personalities patoki all sinful personalities they are doing all sinful activities every day and night they in different pilgrimage so naturally the potency of those pilgrimage going down so the potency of that planet the potency of those you know so the potency so the potency of those you know pilgrimage day by day potency of this you know pilgrimage going down Pol potency of the pilgrimage pilgrimage going down so they wanted to revive recharge by giving their food dust there that's why they wanted to travel all around bhumandal in bhu bhulok this this lok devi dham bhulok they can travel time to time they can go here and there to recharge all those pilgrimage this was the this was the calculation this was their desire so they came अकस्मागतास्त्रो भृगुमुख्या महर्षयो पद्याम पावित यातीर्था कृपया भुवि वाट स्पीकिंग अकस्मागतास्त्रो भृगुमुख्या महर्षयो पद्याम पावयुत यातीर्थने कृपया भुवि दैट्स वाई विथ दिस मोटिव विथ दिस वेरी विथ दिस वेरी डिवाइन पर्फास् दे 
reached heavenly planet and from heaven they can go down in the bhulok in on this earth i mean the surface where we are living he wanted to go here and there the different pilgrimage to revive the charge of that pilgrimage that's why आकस्मादागतास्तत्रो भृगुमुख्या महर्षयु पद्यां पावय यातीर्था ने कृपया भुवि दे वॉन्टेड टू रिच हट वेरी मर्सीफुल दैट्स ऑफ विदाउट इन्वाइटेशन दे आर कमिंग नाउ वन क्वेश्चन कैन कम हाउ दे कैन टच हेवेनली how they can catch touch this earth because we know it for sure those who are living in a higher planet when they are coming here they are never going to touch this earth any demigods anybody coming here from higher planet they are surely not going to touch this earth follow so how it is possible for them then sanatan gosain was speaking really we know usually they are not going to touch this earth but those mercy they are very merciful according to the kripa shakti according to the kripa shakti of bhagwan according to the kipa shakti of bhagwan it was possible for them to travel all around in on this earth special power that's mean by the special power of bhagwan they can touch this earth with this motive they are coming because when they are going to when they are taking this kind of divine seva it is one kind of seva as per the desire of bhagwan when they are going to discharge their duty seva this way when they are coming down in this material world they are not going to keep any for they have in that case you cannot discover any false ego inside them devarshi maharshi we are devarshi we are maharshi we are devarshi we are maharshi this kind of false ego surely that time not saying that surely sanatan goswami is speaking surely when they are coming to do some good for us on this material world by the inspiration of bhagwan going to touch attachment when they are going to travel all around different pilgrimage on this earth in that case they are they are devarshi maharshi this kind of false ego surely cannot stay in padma puran uttarakhand in padma puran उत्तरखंड पूर्वखंड उत्तरखंड उत्तरखंड सेकेंड पार्ट पद पुराण उत्तरखंड इट इज रिटेन भगवान वॉज बाउंड टू गिव ऑर्डर टू दिस मनी रिसीस टू रिचार्ज ऑल डिफरेंट पिलग्रमेज ऑलरेडी इन अ लूजिंग पोटेंसी इट वॉज द ऑर्डर ऑफ भगवान सो अकॉर्डिंग टू द ऑर्डर दे दे started traveling in different pilgrimage beneath the bhavavalin but before starting they wanted to put one question in front of bhagwan when bhagwan wanted to engage them when bhagwan wanted to engage when bhagwan wanted to engage them engage them in this kind of seva i mean you can travel different pilgrimage and research because the potency going going drop so you can recharge there 
this kind of order was given by bhagwan to them then that time out of humble attitude they they started speaking to bhagwan that time when when according to the order of bhagwan or manirishis from mahar mahar loka they are ready to go in the in this you know in material world to travel all around different pilgrimage to revive the potency of different pilgrimage that time the first question that time the first question on behalf of those rishi manis were that well we can go there to revive the potency of different places and those sinful those were those were sinful those were sinful men those were sinful men mahapatoki very very heavy sinful men they can get free they can get free na by our touch swasvar pam you know okay so when they are speaking in front of bhagwan bhagwan we are going to this art to deliver all big big sinful man they can get free pap mukto they can get free of any papa kintu kintu when we are going to get all papa when we are going to deliver those sinful man from papa their papa can arise and make us make our heart make contaminated malin so what is the way out bhagwan if we are going to help them to cut papa where papa can go this papa can come and contaminate our heart kintu so this way this way all vishumun is speaking in front of bhagwan we can lose we can lose our potency we can lose our glories our we can lose our glories uh, what is the solution for the what is the way out so the question was there i mean those rishis rishimunis from this maharlok they are putting question in front of bhagwan bhagwan we are ready to uh, we are ready to di- discharge our duty uh, and our seva we are ready but how we can get free of this kind of contamination which is supposed to come if i am going to deliver because you can remember in chaitanya bhagavat jagai madai was delivered by nitananda gauranga mahaprabhu but there it is written when jagai madai was delivered from these sinful activities countless countless sinful activities jagai madai was successful to come out but bhagwan in front of devotee wanted to show that i have taken all sinful you know all papa from them so goranga mapu do molten gold complexion of the body but still everybody could see that bhagwan is now black like krishna totally all sinful you know result of the sinful activities done by jagai madai all were taken by bhagwan all so all devotee suddenly all devotee suddenly could discover 
the body color of goranga mahaprabhu is now black after taking all sin from them so it is appropriate question it is it is reasonable question actually so all rishimuni is asking if we are going to take all the sins from those sinful men in the material world they in in our contact that can get they can get free but all sins can come and contaminate our heart then how we can get free that is the question in padma puran you can find this kind of question then bhagwan speaking no but then bhagwan that bhagwan replied bhagwan started thinking sat started speaking don't worry bhagwan speaking oh no don't worry why you are so much you know anxious be sure i myself in the form of different sadhu can come and travel different pilgrimage you know vaman karibo so all your sin i mean contamination can go away <coughs> and you can get your original pratishtha your glorification your glories can get the same pratishtha as was before you are not going to lose your glories because i myself in the form of different sadhu guru vishnu i can travel all around different kind of you know pilgrimage there and due to my travel all your contamination can go away and you can get back your previous glories glorification your own pratishtha you can get back don't worry for that you can get back no problem this way bhagwan going to give assurance this way bhagwan going to give assurance to all maharlok vasi those rishi manis those are coming from maharlok bhagwan going to speak this way then all demigods and rishi mani those who already came from maharlok together with brahaspati and baman dev vishnu dev swayam himself you know all the demigods and rishi those who are staying in heavenly planet all those demigods and those rishis those who are staying in heavenly planet brahaspati and and uh, vishnu himself all they started worshiping maharshi those maharshi they are not rishi they are maharshi maharishi maharshi those were reaching heavenly planet from maharlo gopakumar speaking i was really very i was really stunned to see all these events i was really surprised to see i was really surprised to see what is happening all maharshi they are coming those who are rare darshan they are rare, their darshan is so rare even big big personality they cannot get rishiman maharshi is now they are reaching here in heavenly planet and all demigods and rishi those who are staying in heaven together with brahaspati and what to speak more even vishnu i mean bamandev they all started worshiping maharshi i was very stunned to see this event because i am new here because i am new here i never saw this kind of strange thing how possible i i because i have no full information about heaven i was never been in heaven previously as yes, now you know this this for the first time i am coming here so i don't know the dignity of this you know this ceremony is everything you know because i was only busy with the service of vishnu
So, according to the instruction of Devaguru Vrespati and all demigods, as a king, uh, Guru Gan, to worship them, they give me order. They are going to show the procedure, but they give me the responsibility worship. I mean, I myself started worshiping those, those you know, Maharshis appropriately according to the guidance of Devguru Vrespati or all demigods there. And uh, though Vishnu Bhagavan, Bhaman Dev is there, but still as a king it was my responsibility. Na? It was the responsibility of Indra, the king of heaven, but he is not here. What to do? Ahan chavi nabu Vishnu zevanandu hirtantara no jane tanatho shiyoi predito stoi rapu jayam. Today I am going to stop here actually because after that long discussion is due and every day due to this internet problem I am feeling pain inside my heart. So maybe from next day I can change the time of my Harikatha. I mean Hindi Harikatha I can speak from 8 to 10 and after that 10.30 to 12.30. I, I, I am thinking I can discuss and I, I like to uh, you know announce it. Excuse me, please bear with me what to do. I am very sorry. Nigamo kalpataror galitam phalam sukhamukhadam rita dava sangyutam pivato bhagavatam rasamalayam mohraho rasika bhubibhavuka vancha kalpataroshike basindhi bhavichapati dhanan pavanibhyo vishnavibhyo namon.